This is MC Reggie Fresh on the MC Reggie Fresh Morning Show. And today, folks, I got my main man, Pooh, in barber school in 1997 in Louisville, Kentucky, Kentucky College of Barber. He's on the line with me right now. What's going on, bro? Hey, what's going on, man? What's up? Hey, Re hey, hey Pooh, man. You know, bro, it's barber business or something else, man. But I tell you what, man, I wouldn't change it for nothing. What you said, what you said. Hey, so, 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 how long you been a barber, bro? Man, I've been a barber for like 15 years, 15, 16 years, man. Get out of here, man. Now, what, one, what, what made you want to become a barber? Man, just trying something new, man. I, a talent that I knew, I, that I uh, thought, I, thought I didn't have, but, you know what I'm saying, it came through for me. Came yeah. through for, because, shoot, I remember, I remember when you used to work, where'd you used to work at? Man, I used to work at Kmart. Work at Walmart. Man, yeah. I worked it all over, all over the place, bro. I already know, man. And then you finally found that niche, man. And shoot, barber school was something else, man. We had a good time in barber school, didn't we, bro? Right, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I know we cut a lot of cuts, man. We cut a lot of heads for about nine months for free. Well, that's what we thought, but we was getting paid anyway. <laughs> yeah, remember that? <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, man. So let me ask you this. So, uh, of the course of going through barbering, man, being a barber, what's some of the things that you learned, man? Man, over the course of years, man, I learned basically how to be patient, man. Be patient with people. Right. Man, uh, you know, learning the cuts, you know, all through the years, you know, you never, you never get tired of learning, man. It's always, it's a learning process throughout the years, man, that you, you know what I'm saying, that you barber. So you're always learning something. Exactly. And, always, and how old was you, how old was you when you went to barber school? Uh, I think I was like 23, Yeah, man. you about 23, yeah? Okay. I remember, bro. I remember. Hey, barbering, barbering had changed everything for you, bro. Change your address, change your car, change everything. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's what you, it's what you up. Or you say, if you know how to manage your money, you better believe it. Now, uh, what I want to ask you now, man, is do do you uh do you want to give anybody some shout outs? Man, I want to give a shout out, man, to Streeter, man. I want to give a shout out to you, man. I want to give a shout out to you know all the barbers, man, that made it, man, that was out there. We you know when we was doing it. Man, all all those folks, man. Skip everybody, man. That's what I'm saying, man. Cause you know what, man? That's where it all started at, bro. Right, right. Was on Third Street, Kentucky College of Barbers. Kentucky College of Barbers, man. Third Street. <laughs> <laughs> man, it seemed like yesterday, bro. Right, right. Man, right, man. it seemed like yesterday. Hey, Pooh, man, you know, I'm glad to hear from you, man, because, you know, like I say, I ain't, I don't get to talk to you that much because I don't live down there that much, man. But I'm glad right. you came on my show, bro. And the last question I want to ask you, could you tell me what's the baddest station in the land and the baddest station that pays? For sure, man, the MC Ready Fresh Morning Show. You got it, Pooh, bro. And there you have it. That's Pooh out of Louisville, Kentucky on the MC Ready Fresh Morning Show.